what you doing? Oh, oh, sorry about that internet. I'm not singing this weekend. What's up? How you doing? As you guys know, uh, we recently got some uh, locally sourced, organically grown, shipped from overseas Dragonstone. So uh, this is a little bit of the behind the scenes of going uh, to gather it from nature and bring it home so that we could put it into my natural aquascape which is a 240 gallon acrylic tank and I love it it's not my favorite but I love it can't have favorite children right uh, as you can see here there's a secret secret warehouse through many 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 secret doors which I could not uh, accurately film all of the um, all of the secret doors uh, which I had to go through, but I'll give you some action shots of just a couple of them. Now, the nondescript nature of this warehouse space, why is that? Well, this is where the stacks and stacks and stacks of boxes of uh, stone are at, and then what I had to do is I had to source the ones that were going to basically work in the 240. So, a lucky opportunity for me to uh, roll out here into nature, and gather up these stones and uh, be able to, you know, select the ones out of the ground. <laughs> All right, yeah. So obviously, uh, these are from a store, a local, uh, local fish store, the Aquarium Co-op in Edmonds. I'm pretty sure you guys have heard of them, uh, but they do have a uh, a bit of a collection of uh, Dragonstone. They ship it out to people and stuff like that. And I got a a pretty lucky opportunity to be able to sort through their big. Uh, all their boxes and stuff of this uh, of this Dragonstone tastes delicious, by the way. Um, and I uh, was able to basically find the the additional five pieces that were going to go into the 240. That's going to make for basically ten sizable chunks of uh, Dragonstone in that scape. So I'm happy to say that we're finally going to have nothing but Dragonstone in that aquarium. Just one type of rock. You guys know it's pretty expensive this stuff, so doing a big aquarium with it it's kind of cost prohibitive to go into doing a really big tank so um, it took a while to get here but this week we will be scaping with this rock and putting it in and moving all the other ones around and stuff like that to get it uh, to get it set up and look look darn tootin delicious you know what I'm saying and uh, I'm pretty excited to get that done honestly um, it's been a, it's been kind of a long wait to kind of source the right big stones that I needed uh, in order to get this to happen, normally these stones, because of them being expensive, are normally broke down into little shards and stuff like that. So uh, I'm happy to get it in. I'm looking forward to getting a video of that stuff out to you guys. Uh, tune in Monday through Friday, 4 o'clock to 5 o'clock for the live show. Later.